I mean, I guess it, if BuzzFeed says so. <laughs> I don't know if you guys knew this, but there's actually a website that can literally predict your future and it's known to be 100% accurate. So today I'm going to go on that website and like take some quizzes, you know, learn some things about myself, <laughs> make some plans for the new year. The website I'm talking about is called BuzzFeed, uh, the largely popular and uh, very accurate high quality news source. BuzzFeed. I'm sorry. I just want to take some BuzzFeed quizzes, okay? It's my first day of school. I'm stressed. I'm sick. Do you hear my voice? I just need to know if I'm gonna get married, okay? <laughs> Ever. And other such important information. But honestly, first and probably most importantly, there's this website uh, that people can like make quizzes on and I googled Lil Simsy quiz because I knew that these two existed. But this one I think is new. Obviously these two are from 2016, they're um, old, <laughs> but 2018, I might not have taken this yet. Am I a Lil Simsy fan? I must find out. Celebrities and fame, by the way. <laughs> How often do you watch her I love potatoes? <laughs> Who? Every day, usually twice a day, I also watch her daily Twitch streams. As often as I can, sometimes I'm too busy. Um, well, I, I do uh, actually watch all my videos and streams because I am there for them. So, what is Lil Simsy's real name? Kayla, or is it Potato? Kelly, Kayla Sims, Kayak Simulator, all of the above. Um, all of the above? My husband and I think you're a narcissist. That needs a story. This one time, I got a hate comment on a build tutorial video that I did, and this person, um, she explained how her and her husband sit down to watch my YouTube videos. You know, every day, dinner time, on the couch, watching some Simsy vids, as you do. Uh, and she commented, uh, I forget the direct quote, but essentially it said that her husband and I thought I was a narcissist for making a build tutorial. And I just, the image of this woman and her husband sitting down together over dinner, you know, being like, wow, this 16 year old girl, narcissist, <laughs> for making a build tutorial video. Anyway, she's right, so. Okay, roof story, long story, don't even worry about it, dumb. <laughs> Who's Susan? Wait, how am I supposed to know? Is there like a correct answer to this quiz? What if I'm not a Lil Simsy fan? I don't know the right answers. I'll beat up Susan, I'm not even worried about it. Blue Suburbans, blue potatoes. <laughs> oh, if Lil Simsy's late, you call her Lil Lacey and then she cries about it on stream. What did she call herself after she dyed her hair purple, purple and wore a yellow sweater? I don't know. I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna lose, I'm gonna, I'm gonna lose the Simsy quiz. I think, I mean, I, I looked like Barney, but when I wore a yellow sweater, I, I vaguely remember calling myself a bruised banana because I have purple hair and the yellow sweater on and I was like, haha. But what if I'm wrong? My sister's name is Shanna. I know that for a fact, at least. <laughs> Who the heck is Rick Astley? <laughs> um, I indeed follow, what, oh. I wish I went to her collage so I, <laughs> so I could follow her around there too. Oh dear, please don't follow me around school. <laughs> <gasps> I'm a true Lil Simsy Thank God. You follow her wherever she goes. <laughs> well, you know what? I do go everywhere that Lil Simsy goes, I guess. So, it's true. Share my results on Twitter. <laughs> I got true Lil Simsy stand. No, that's not funny. That would be a horrible tweet. Okay, there's also a BuzzFeed quiz of where you can build a house on The Sims, um, and they'll guess my age with 92% accuracy. And you better, Kelly Martinez, get it right, or else I'll be really, really ashamed of you. Where do I want to live? Okay, honestly, generic Willow Creek, I'm picking it. Interesting how it's just Sims 2 and Sims 4, but whatever. What's my budget? Motherload, come on! I'm not building a cheap Sims house, okay? This is a horrible house! I'll pick the pleasant house, don't give me that. Pick a style, okay. How about a Victor- no, a craftsman. Come on. Pick a bedroom- you- <laughs> Who made this quiz? Okay, Victoria, I'm sorry. You really put Cassandra Goth's room in this? And I think this might be from the Goth house in The Sims 3. I could be wrong, but I'm I'm really ashamed of you, Victoria, because I'm about to pick Cassandra Goth's room, and that's embarrassing. It's like she just googled Sims and was like, Sims rooms, and then grabbed these pictures. Okay, she didn't do that, because these are all good. These are all like CC, magical, beautiful rooms. <laughs> Never mind, sorry, Victoria. Choose something extra. I want a fireplace so bad in real life, but I live in Florida, um, so that's not really a thing. <laughs> a minor inconvenience. Oh, a pool with no ladder, that's fine. 30 plus! I do not, in fact, remember The Sims busting out like it was yesterday. The Sims busting out came out on December 2nd, 2003. I was four years old. Shame. You're wrong. And I don't look like Mortimer Goth. Uh, sorry, it's scrolled way too far. <laughs> Hang on, wait. Lil Simsy. Okay. Well, <laughs> We'll tell you the name of your soulmate based on the food you like. Okay, we need this. Pick a meal. Oh my god. 
Well, I can't eat any of these things. I think this salad has cheese on it too. Pick a side dish, oh. First of all, these veggies look horrible. That's so weird. Is that fish? I'm picking fries. I'm embarrassed to be around you. Oh, juice. For dessert, I'm going cookies. I'm gonna be honest. Who pays the bill on your night out? <laughs> we dine and ditch. No. Jeff. <laughs> Jeff Bezos? Jeff, I know that you are recently divorced and I'd just like to point out that I, um, I have a boyfriend, but I can get rid of him. Okay, now they're claiming to guess when I'll get married based on the cake that I bake, which I really enjoy the concept of that, so. Okay, I'm making a circle cake with four layers and it's chocolate flavored with, um, well, what, I don't want, I want like chocolate and caramel, you know? I don't want, mm, what decoration on top? Oh, how about some berries? And I'll have, um, you know, I don't like cake that much. <laughs> I'll just get one slice. In one year, better get planning. This is news to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what tattoo should I get? All right, if I eat my way through Europe, I can find out. Oh boy. Oh, wait. I want some pizza. Or lasagna. Oh, pizza. <laughs> English food? I'm sorry. You guys, you just lose. Like, <laughs> so sad. Oh, salad. <laughs> I just got excited about strawberries, so I picked the salad. Churros? Oh, boy. A character slash animal I'm sorry. There is literally no way you would catch me getting a giant lion face on my are BuzzFeed. Oh, design a mansion and they'll tell me how many kids I will have. Okay. <laughs> These are pretty. Um, I like this one. I build it in The Sims. <laughs> Pick a kitchen. Oh my god. Okay. Honestly, I like this one. Oh. The two-story, like with the, oh, these are so pretty. I do not relate to this at all. Imagine if your bedroom was this big. <laughs> if you had windows like that in your bedroom. And if your bathroom was, imagine in this tub. That, I, and the shower in the middle of the room like that. Where, where are these places? <laughs> Who has this kind of money? Pick a nursery. Oh, okay. I like that one. I don't know. <laughs> How do you pick these things? Okay, when I was a child, if I had a bed like this, I would have been so happy. I wanted a cool bed so bad when I was a kid. And honestly, I think I'm glad my parents didn't get me like a loft bed kind of thing because if they had, I think I would have regretted it when I was in high school. But when I was in like elementary, middle school, I wanted a fancy loft bed with like my desk underneath so badly. <laughs> that was like my dream. Pick an extra, <gasps> oh my God, this library is so cool. But I've said so many times that I want a movie like cinema room in my house so badly. I think this is like a little bit too much. <laughs> Um, this is more achievable, I feel like, but the idea of having like a, a movie theater in your house is like the coolest thing in the world to me. And honestly, if you got an extra room, you could put like a projector up and have like a movie room. It doesn't need to have like reclining cinema chairs, you know, <laughs> like you could pull it off. My friends rented a house last year in like the middle of nowhere in England, so it was cheap. <laughs> but they like, people that lived there previously were like gonna sell it, decided to rent it instead. So they had like their personal movie room set up in the house still. And it was just like a big couch and a projector screen on the wall that had like the TV and you could like hook your computer up to it and stuff. But it was so cool and I was so jealous and they moved out of that house now, which is really rude, but like lucky, amazing. Five kit, there is literally no way. I'm not, no, no, <laughs> I would rather die. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> I'm getting married next year and having five kids. Okay, to be fair though, if it's with Jeff Bezos, at least they'll be well taken care of and I can like hire someone to deal with them. Oh, but five pregnancies. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm fine. It's fine. Pick out eight visco girl items and we'll guess your relationship status. Honestly, this whole like visco girl business is kind of a dead meme now. And it was kind of an annoying meme, like making fun of girls for things that are like normal to like. I mean like scrunchies and water bottles. Calm down, you know? But um, <laughs> I'm curious if I am single or not. Choose some scrunchies. Oh boy. I like these. I like the green one. <laughs> I don't have a hydro flask. I have this from Target. <laughs> Oh, I want to put broccoli on my hydro flask. All right, I can't get behind the Crocs thing. I'm sorry, but this one is purple and sparkly, which maybe is too much, but you know what? That's okay. They're Crocs. In themselves, they are too much. Avocado. I'm just putting vegetables on my hydro flask. Okay, I can't get behind any of these. I'm sorry. I know the, the their quality is very bad of these images too. Just the idea of wearing a giant shirt with Billie Eilish's face on it. I, I can't get behind that. <laughs> and this baby Yoda one like that dumb meme too. I don't know I don't know what blue moon is, but this is the most acceptable shirt of these all plus it's a long sleeve I would like that. I, I do have one of these backpacks. Mine is all pink not with the blue straps, but I like this one too <laughs> See you get made fun of for having metal straws now engaged. I did not know this I mean, I guess if I'm getting married next year. It makes sense Sh Should I tell my boyfriend this? Is it Jeff that I'm engaged to or not? Should I be concerned? I mean, I guess it 
If BuzzFeed says so. <laughs> this ring is way too big for that finger. Oh, they can tell how old I am based on my knowledge of internet slang. Oh boy. Are you serious? Until we understand you. <laughs> I was gonna think I was gonna do bad on this, but um, at least I know what uwu means. <laughs> ha ha, but it's a typo. Oh boy. It means a lot of things. Correct. That, yeah, okay, thank you, BuzzFeed. Soft, signing off for today. <laughs> Singled out for trying. This is one of the worst quizzes I've ever seen in my entire life. I don't know this one. It's certainly not one of these stupid ones. <laughs> Bay, but it's for dads? Oh. It's, does anyone else? Are you serious? I've never seen anyone else. Uh, no, 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 no. I've never seen anyone use this in, their, in my entire life. I've never seen this before. That's a stupid one. Stupid. Is this one a bad word? Uh, fix that for you. Are you serious? Okay, I scrolled past it. It's fine. No bad words on my stream. I'm sorry. <laughs> Monday, Friday, Wednesday. That's really embarrassing. I have never seen this one either. How I feel when? Are you serious? My editor needs to <laughs> cover these bad words. <laughs> I'm scared. Yeet. Um, I- is it all of these? Yeah, it basically means throw, but like, these freaks use yeet in the weirdest contexts. I feel like this word has no meaning anymore. Tea. <laughs> it just means tea. I only got 6 out of 11 right, which means I must be between 21 and 35 years old. Which honestly, um, I'm 20, but I'm embarrassed. <laughs> as a person who works on the internet. However, these were dumb. Okay, it's not my fault, they're just stupid. I'm not the stupid one, it's them, they're stupid. These quizzes are so stupid. <laughs> I mean, I knew going into it they were. I've done this many times on stream, but I'm genuinely embarrassed that I'm doing this right now. <gasps> Which Sims expansion pack are you? Oh no, this is the good stuff. Choose a Simlish phrase. Ah, uh, oh, Phoebe Lay is the easy answer. Choose a color, oh, pink. What is my goal in life? Oh. I want to be surrounded by cats. Choose a sim. Oh, we're playing the sims 3. Why are they all sims 3? Well, we got one sims 2 and one sims 4. I'm embarrassed to be around these people. I think this girl kind of looks like me though, so... <laughs> my favorite time of year. Well, um, my school semester started today, so shall I pick when a new school term starts? Choose a holiday destination. Oh, I'm picking New York. <laughs> what is my dream job? Oh, none of these. Ghost Hunter? No, I'm gonna pick Explorer. Choose a film. Oh boy. I have not seen many of these, but I'm going to pick Back to the Future. <laughs> what word describes me best? Adventure, psychic, loyal. Why just adventure? <laughs> famous, tenacious, studious, loving, glamorous, progressive. I'm sorry. I feel really tempted to- I'm not famous by any means. <laughs> Pick it. I am- I'm actually the biggest YouTuber on the planet. I- I have, um, I'm the biggest YouTuber. Like, the tallest, um, I'm- I'm eight feet tall. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm actually 5'5", five five, just- just for the record. Okay, choose a dish. All of these look terrible. This lunch meat sandwich is just a big loaf of bread. I wanna pick that. This seems to be supernatural! I wanna start crying! This is literally my least favorite expansion pack of all time! Oh my god! No, I don't want to do this anymore. I feel really offended right now, like genuinely upset about this. Buzzfeed is stupid. I hate Buzzfeed. No. no. You know what? No, I'm done. Buzzfeed's stupid. I'm sorry. This is kind of a weird, dumb video, but you know what? Sometimes I just want to have some fun, okay? And I was having fun until Buzzfeed ruined it. I'm serious. I feel like actually offended right now. You know how I feel about supernaturals in The Sims. It's fine. The Sims 3 Supernatural was the last expansion I ever bought for The Sims 3, and I only bought it because I wanted to have all of them. And it was also on sale for like $5, so I was like, yeah, fine. Okay, to be fair though, they do have in that pack a gem cutter, <laughs> and you can use it, like you can send your Sims dogs out hunting for gems, and then they come back with them, and then you can cut them in the gem cutter, and then you can get super rich. And I played a lot of legacy challenges in The Sims 3, so I would have my Sims dogs make me money that way, and it's like, kind of the best way to get rich in The Sims 3. So, maybe it's okay. Maybe it is fitting. <laughs> The gem cutter is great. Am I allowed to say that? I hate Supernatural. Okay, whatever, I'm sorry, fine. It's fine, I'm fine. You guys, though, please wish me luck. Um, today's the first day of my last semester of college. It's my last first day of school. I haven't cried yet, but I, I did look at all of my uh, classes this morning, read some, the syllabus for many of them. The syllabus for one of them almost made me cry. So, I'll be okay. <laughs> 
we're almost there. I also spent a lot of money on textbooks, like a ridiculous amount, and I was really upset about it. Two of my classes can only buy the textbook from my school's bookstore, which we all know is very expensive and ridiculous, because one of them was written by the professor that I have, so you have to buy her textbook from the school, because the only place you can buy it is from the school, and it's new this year, so there's no used copies, you can't get it anywhere else, and you have to buy it from my campus bookstore. It is $80 for an online copy, for like an access code to the ebook. $80! It's fine. I'm fine. Anyway, um, <laughs> how are you guys doing? Let me know in the comments down below, but I'm gonna go, so please make sure to leave a like and comment and subscribe and do all those funny YouTube things, and in case you guys didn't know, I post new videos every single day, and so I will see you all tomorrow. <laughs> Bye, everybody. What Sims expansion pack are you? I, I wonder if they're all only Sims 3 ones because I'm really offended that I got Supernatural and I kind of want to take the quiz again and change my answer because how dare they? How dare they call me a zombie freak?